Police say a Warner Robins woman was killed by another woman this morning, making her the city's ninth homicide victim this year. Investigators say it happened at the Foxwood Apartments off Watson Boulevard. Pepper Baker talked to a neighbor about waking up to a post-holiday tragedy. Police responded to a call around 547 this morning involving a domestic dispute here in this apartment building that ended in a fatal stab wound. Neighbors from Foxwood townhomes woke up to find a crime scene right outside of their door. Anita Thomas says she was alerted by the sound of sirens. It was the loudest thing I ever heard. Really loud. I mean, it was scary. Jennifer Parson with the Warner Robins police explains what the officers found once they got there. One um, victim, a female that opened the door. When she opened the door, the suspect came down the stairs and um, stabbed her in front of the officers. The suspect is 25 year old Shanika Renee Smith. Parson says police saw her with a knife in her hand and told her to drop it. Instead, they said she lunged and stabbed 31 year old Monice Tracy Howard Roberts. The officers at that point deployed their taser to eliminate the situation, to stop it from happening and rendered aid to the victim. Roberts died at a local hospital from two stab wounds to the upper chest that severed an artery. Smith has been charged with murder and aggravated assault. Thomas says it's alarming. I don't really know whether to be settled, but I'll be on guard. Doors will be locked. Parson said the two women involved were in a relationship. Police say this wasn't the first time the couple had a history of violence. In Warner Robins, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. Police say Smith was recently arrested on battery and obstruction charges and was released from jail yesterday.